Well, this is a, a topic um, that's really grown over the last maybe 15 to 20 years is neuroimmune science. I remember David Butler introduced it to me 20 years ago and I, I really didn't know what he was talking about. Um, what I've learned is that uh, what we've learned in, in research and, and science is that every uh, neural synapse has cells with immune function. Um, so in, in, I think in the glia, um, the number of immune cells or glial cells uh, in the brain, for example, is like 50 to 1. So there are so many synapses. And this is part of the reason that pain and how we respond to different stimuli is so complex because of the connections um, and the immune connections and how these things communicate. So while we used to have a course, mobilization of the nervous system, we've now changed it to mobilization of the neuroimmune system. And uh, yeah, and that's a way also I am, we can communicate to patients is rather than thinking of just nerves as being their own entity, tying it into a immune response can be a nice way that we can communicate this information.